Alright, this is going to be kind of like a part one. Uh, this video is probably not going to go up until sometime in September or October and there's going to be a few parts to it. This is me um, editing my Scentsy Club only because today is Tuesday, August 29th and I don't know if I'm going to have time tomorrow or the next day to edit my Scentsy Club and things are going away on October, uh, sorry, August 31st through September 1st. So I want to make sure that sort of things happen. Um, this bi-monthly here in the middle is probably going to be going away because that was just me ordering those bricks. Um, but I'm not going to bother dealing with it yet. I'll deal with it next month or whatever. Um, but I am going to be doing a couple of things in here. So now what I would love to do is I would love to skip this order. I told you guys that. Uh, I would love to skip this. If I skip October... I lose Sugar, Stargazing, and Wally. Now, I could totally handle missing out on Stargazing and Wally. But Sugar, I, I just can't do it. I, I feel so strongly about Scentsy Club. You guys know that. I place a lot of value in it. I love certain fragrances. I'm very particular with my fragrances. I, don't, I pretty much don't like anything that's bakery. And that's like what most people love. Sorry if my neighbors are so fucking noisy this morning. I know, listen, it's nine o'clock in the morning, so they have the right to be noisy, but Jesus. So anyway, I'm not going to be skipping this. I am going to be doing, I'm going to try a tactic that a couple, of, this is just so noisy. I can't handle it. I'm going to try a tactic that um, a couple of people told me about, and uh, I'm going to try to push my club uh, to, to monthly and then switch it back to quarterly and see what happens and blah, blah, blah. So I'm going to hit do not skip this shipment because I cannot handle missing out on sugar, which is crazy that I'm going to get a $200 shipment just because to save one bar. But that's how strongly I feel. That's how strongly I feel about sugar, which is kind of ironic because the first time I was introduced to sugar was back in the spring of 2017 when it came out in a brick and they had a sugar and a shimmer brick and I had never experienced that in my oh my god anyway i love sugar so much um but i'm going to be doing a little bit of pruning in here first thing i'm going to do is i'm going to add more items anyway there's a couple of bars that i want to put in because they're going to be going away a little bit faster than i thought they were going to um the friends bar is already going away it hasn't even been out for a month so whatever i'm going to be adding that because i love it um I, I don't think I'm going to add more than that. I'm, I've already ordered two more for myself. And then if I get one every three months, that's okay with me. Um, sort of thinking about pink leather, but I'm not quite convinced yet. I don't have to make that decision right away because it's the scent of the month right now. So I don't have to make that decision right now. Tahitian Twilight, again, I don't have to make that decision right now because it was the scent of the month last month. And if it goes away before I get a chance to put it in my club, that's fine. I already have two in my stock curing, so to speak. Um... I thought this was a big old waste of time. If you saw my last video, you know that Dream Big Princess is a total waste of time. But I'm also going to be putting into my Scentsy Club um, only one from the Spring Summer Collection. And that is Mountain Sunset, which I only warmed once the entire time it was in the catalog because, okay, you guys know that I have a small place and I have other things in my life. I'm not just a Scentsy consultant and there aren't enough hours in the day and there aren't enough rooms in my home to warm. This is where I get kind of frustrated. I don't have time to warm any of the stuff that I love. I feel like because I want to warm all of the new stuff one at a time so that I can concentrate on it, take notes, make specific reviews about it for my customers and they put out so much new stuff so often, especially now, oh my God, in the past two weeks, I haven't even had a chance to get through all of the stuff that's coming out in three days now and on September 1st. And then we've got holiday stuff coming out. On, on September 1st, I, we get early access to all the holiday stuff. When am I supposed to warm all this stuff? Anyway, did I edit? I don't remember if I edited it. I'm adding it again. I don't know, I'll go back and I'll look at it. Um, 
Review subscription, I added two by mistake. Let me go in and, and change that. Oh no, I didn't, I only added one. Okay, so I added this one and this one. And I will be taking out Pima Cotton. How do I do that now? Hold on, let me update the subscription. It's really not that bad. Uh, let's start at the bottom because there's a few down here that I really don't. Okay, I'm going to be taking out Wizarding World, not because I don't want it. How do I take it out? How do I take it out? Oh, see, now the garbage can is in here. Do you remember that that happened with me on my other computer too? Where's the garbage can? How come I can't take anything out? And I can't change it to zero. Okay, so here I go. There we go. There's the little garbage pails. So I'm on my laptop right now. Anyway, so I'm going to be taking out Wizarding World because that's going to be in the uh, catalog next season. So that's the only reason why I'm taking it out. I really love that fragrance, and I already have one or two in my stash. Um, I'm going to be taking out Cucumber and Cactus Water. I have one in my stash, and I'm kind of over it. Okay, I'm going to be taking out French Lavender because that's already, um, but I'm sorry, that's going to be in um, the catalog next season. I am taking out Summerberry Melon. Now, I did finally warm this one and Orchard by the Sea. When I had gotten these delivered during my last club uh, unboxing, I forgot to warm them. I just, I, I alphabetized them and I shuffled them away into my... Uh, my stash. So I knew that I was going to do this video today. So over yesterday and today, at first I warmed Summerberry Melon. Here's your little review of these two. Not that it matters because if you don't have them in your club, you can't get them right now. I thought Summerberry Melon was super boring. It was nice and fruity, but it really was like kind of gone in like the first five or six hours, which is fine. It put a smile on my face when I was on there. I think it's got like raspberry and strawberry and pineapple and something else. It was fine, but it wasn't up to what I want something to be. And it definitely didn't have any place in my Scentsy Club. Orchard by the Sea uh, was more of a boomer. It was a lot stronger. I have it going in my living room right now. I do need to take it out just because, like I said, I need to get through all these damn laxes. Um, but I'm still smelling it. So Orchard by the Sea is nice. It's sea salt air. I don't know floating lotus blah 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 karma flower this and that i don't know something um it's okay I, it's just to, to me it's not club worthy we have stuff like this every day all the time maybe not so much in the winter time in the catalog but it's okay it's in the make a splash iridescent pearl um you know um what is it glacier water category okay it's going it's gone Goodbye. Uh, I am not going to be taking Pink Apple and Nectarine, which is in that same um, collection, out because I absolutely love that bar. In fact, can I put two? Can I change it to two? <gasps> no, I can't. Okay, anyway, whatever. Um, I am going to be taking out Cashmere and Corduroy because it is going to be in the catalog next season in three days. It's amazing that the next season is in three days. And then I think, oh no, I'm going to take out Pima Cotton. Because I feel like, especially with frosty air that's coming, did you guys warm frosty air yet? Well, you're actually not going to see this video for like two or three months. Today's August 29th. Oh my God, frosty air is so good. Um, so anyway, I don't feel the need for that, but I am going to be keeping all this stuff. $113, which is great. And again, I'm going to be canceling this one. I'm just, there's no reason for me to cancel it now. After September 1st hits, then I might start adding some stuff, some stuff that I really like that I haven't quite yet warmed, uh, maybe stuff from the new holiday collections coming out, whatever. Now, what I'm going to do is, on the advice of everybody, around September 10th, I'm going to be changing this bitch from quarterly to monthly. And then, once that happens, I'm going to change it from monthly to quarterly. And then hopefully I won't get a delivery until December. We'll see. A um, couple of people told me to do this. Literally two, uh, no, three or four people told me to do this. But if this is a trick that actually works, and everybody told me that it works, then I'm sure that Sensi knows that this happens. Um, and listen, if it doesn't work, it's okay. Then that just means that I'm going to get that box in October and I'm not opening it. Because <laughs> then I really will, you know, um, skip my January. So whatever. Anyway, I hope everybody has a great day. Bye. 
Hey friends. So I put out a community post about three weeks ago regarding my Scentsy Club subscription. I had every intention of skipping October because I only have, well, I mean, I have this bi-monthly one, but I have to delete that one. Anyway, um, I really, the, the my most important Scentsy Club subscription is my quarterly because it's kind of large. It's about 20 bars, I think. And um, it's really only literally the ones that are my absolute favorite that I can't live without. And not very many of them are seasonal. Um, they are right up my alley. They're perfumey. They're just a little bit fruity. There's construction going on outside, so sorry. Anyway, um, my dilemma is that if I skip this shipment, I lose these first three bars. And I don't want to do that, okay? So I'm going to not do that. Somebody named Teddy D. Wax commented on my, uh, my community post and said there's a hack. Now, another person private messaged me and told me to do the same thing. And she said, I didn't mean to private message you. I didn't want to bother you. But I don't want Sensi to know about this because if they know about this, they're going to change the rules or something like that. I... I don't believe that that's the case, only because I have seen other people talk about this, but I just never really paid attention to it. Um, since he knows all the hacks, I'm pretty sure since he knows all the hacks. Anyway, so I'm going to take a chance. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to change this quarterly subscription to monthly, and then I'm going to change it back to quarterly. And supposedly, that's going to fix it. Cross your fingers, because if I lose this shit, I'm going to be really mad. I mean, I'm hoping that they give me the, the, you know, the, the prompt that, you know what, you're going to miss your stuff. Okay, so I'm going to, I'm so nervous because <laughs> Teddy D. Wax, if this fucks up my subscription, you owe me a cheeseburger. I swear to God. Okay, yes, please change uh, frequency. Okay. So now it says next order is October 10th and I'm going to go in and it's monthly and I'm going to change it back to quarterly, right? I'm so nervous. Yes, please change frequency. Okay. So look, 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 look. December 10th. Oh, thank you, God. <laughs> okay, Teddy D, you're my favorite person in the world right now. Thank you so much. I'm going to post this video and I'm going to, um, when, when I post this video, I'm not going to be posting this video right away. Today I'm doing this on Friday, uh, September 15th, but this video is probably going to, well, I might post it. I have two other videos to attach to this video about me, um, you know, playing with my subscriptions and stuff like that. Um, but thank you so much. Oh my God, I'm so excited. <laughs> thank you. Wax should not make people this excited. Bye. Greetings and salutations. It's Thursday, September 28th, and I have a cold. So <laughs> I sound like garbage, but whatever. Um, I am going to make an adjustment or two to my Scentsy Club, and I'm just going to tack it on to the video again. So <clears throat> I will probably be putting the dates at the bottoms of each of these snippets. Uh, as you saw in my last snippet, I was able to change my quarterly club to be on December 10th. Now I still have a ton of wax. I have not been warming as quickly as I was, you know, a month or two ago. <clears throat> I've just been really super busy. <clears throat> Excuse me. And so I'm wondering if I'm going to give it a shot. On December 1st, I'm going to try to switch this bitch to monthly and then switch it back to quarterly again and see if I can push this off another two months, three months. I'm going to try to do that. And if I lose it, I lose it. It's okay. But in the meantime, I do want to go in here and I do want to add the Open Plains collection. Now, I know that this seems preemptive a bit too preemptive because I haven't even gotten the wax yet. I ordered the whole set uh, whatever day it came out, the 25th, uh, which was Monday. It was only three days ago. And of course, it hasn't even left the warehouse yet. By the way, when you're in New York City and you order Scentsy Wax, don't expect it for a month, okay? <laughs> but anyway, so I'm going to add some more items here. I decided uh, that I, I'm not going to add anything from the fall collection, the Harvest collection. Um, 
I thought about adding Falling Into Love because that really was my favorite in the Harvest Collection, I think. I think. I don't remember. Uh, White Pumpkin and Driftwood was okay, but um, uh, whatever. So um, I'm going to go into Promotions, and I'm going to add all of the Open Plains Collection because I have a feeling I'm going to like all of them. And I, I can just go in and take them out. I have two over two months to um, to make decisions about this. Uh, I saw that somebody was talking about Pacific Mist and that they were so disappointed that it was going away. And they, they I don't think they realized that it's still available to put in your Scentsy Club. So I, I don't remember who you are, but you should if you if that's what you want. Uh, under the oak tree and wide open spaces. Okay. Um, so I just added four $6 bars of wax to my club. And again, I will probably be taking one or two of those out. Listen, I thought that I was going to be putting the whole, um, pink awareness collection in there. We've had it for weeks now and I warmed through all of them and I smelled nothing. <laughs> and it was before I had a gold. So anyway, um, am I going to take anything out? I might be taking out white amber and silk because I think it's available right now, right? I think. Anyway, whatever. Uh, let's let's look at it. Hold on. White amber and silk shop. We'll go to wax. We will sort by Z to A. White amber and cheek. White amber and silk. So I'm going to take white, amber, and silk out, but I can't on this computer. See, okay. As some of you know, I'm using a computer from 2013 because it's got a big, beautiful monitor, 28 inch. It's like you're sitting in front of a movie screen and the clarity, the quality of this monitor is outrageous. My husband is in the film industry and people still talk about this monitor from 2013 and from Mac. Okay. The problem is that I cannot update the security certificate. So half of the uh, websites that I need to go to are like altered. Sometimes they come out in HTML. It's really weird. So I can't take uh, white, amber, and silk out on this computer. I've got to go on my little shitty MacBook Air. <laughs> and anyway, whatever. Um, Starburst Sky I might take out only because... I have, I think, three bars of it. I'm looking forward to having Pink Apple Nectarine again. Uh, ooh, I might take out Rustic Lodge because now I have one bar. And Experiment 626 is available now, so I might take that out. But then that's going to go away again before December. Anyway, I have until December because this is my quarterly, right? So anyway, I'm just going to update the subscription. And there's this um, installment of my... Sensi Club edits. Now, this might be a super long video by the time I get around to publishing it, um, but you know, maybe you just put it on in the background and you fell asleep to it. I don't know. Whatever. Talk to you guys later. Bye.